Hey friends! Today we have a couple of questions that have come to us through social media. So stay tuned, hopefully there's some good stuff in there for you, and welcome to Hurdy Gurdy World! Our first question today comes from Lori D through Facebook. Do you have any recommendations on books or sheet music for my hurdy gurdy? Books. 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 Books! I'm so pleased you asked. I love books greatly and have a couple I would love to discuss today. The first one, if you're looking for straight up music, is a book called Bow Folk. The description here. Bal Folk contains 214 tunes, mostly from central France, and will be of interest to anyone who enjoys playing French music or playing for French dancing. The tunes are suitable for melodeon, fiddle, and accordion, and many will fit within the range of bagpipes and hurdy-gurdy. Uh, my personal experience with this book is that it's one of my favorite for sheet music. It has a, a wide range of tunes, which will be applicable for hurdy-gurdy players in both GC tuning and DG. So however your instrument's set up, I feel like th this book is a really great choice. The second book I will recommend that I love anyway is more of a history book. The Hurdy Gurdy in 18th Century France by Robert Greene. This book is so delicious. It covers a very kind of focused time period in, in the history of the Hurdy Gurdy and French history in the late 1700s, kind of early 1800s. It's got tons of interesting historical tidbits and data and information, uh, great descriptions about the instrument and parts of its evolution. It also has a really wonderful uh, bibliography, or, or not bibliography, resource section at the end where it lists works and compositions specific to the hurdy-gurdy so you can go seek them out and find some really nice music that way. It's not really specifically a music book exactly, although it does have some sheet music in there a little bit as more demonstrations and samples of the styles going on and so forth. Having said that, it's a fascinating read. I adore this book and I hope you pick up a copy. I got mine through Amazon so I know it's out there. Our next question comes from William M. Hey George, what's that cold thing about? Uh, not exactly hurdy-gurdy related, but I'm glad you asked. Uh, I study a form of breathing known as Tumo breathing, specifically the Wim Hof method. Wim Hof is a Dutch endurance athlete who is a proponent of his breathing technique and also combines it with cold exposure, meaning a jump in an icy river, an ice bath, or a cold shower. There's huge health benefits to it, which are outlined in a book called Breath by James Nestor. If you're interested in breathing, this book makes a great study of it and presents some breathing techniques, as well as the health benefits from a lab uh, clinical point of view. Now, the author doesn't exactly teach the Wim Hof method in that book, so it's more about breathing techniques, although he does cover other various breathing techniques. Highly recommended as a book very fascinating. However, if you actually want to learn the Wim Hof method, Wim Hof has videos online. He gives it away for free. It's really cool. So look him up. You'll find ways to learn his method within just a couple of minutes. That's all for today. Thanks so much for joining in as we talked about books. If you have any book recommendations, hurdy-gurdy or otherwise, I'd love to hear about them. I'm somewhat of a book junkie, so leave them in the comments or shoot me a private message. Thanks for joining. Have an awesome day.